What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another episode of the Draft to Glory. Yesterday we won the draft. I know, crazy, right? And we ended up packing um Gundawan and Zakaria was in the pack as well. And a lot of people in the comment section and Josh as well, the video editor, said to me, you just glossed over the fact that you packed a 10k player. Well, he actually not a 10k player. His minimum listing price is 10,000 coins. Nobody buys him because nobody's paying 10,000 coins for him unless you desperately want him. But I think the likelihood of actually selling him for 10,000 coins is pretty slim. Now, if you guys are enjoying the content, if you want to drop a thumbs up on the video, it would be very much appreciated. And before we get into today's draft, guys, set me a challenge in the comment section for two reasons. Number one, we're going to start introducing challenge drafts. That's right, we've achieved the draft of glory. We've already got enough coins to last us a lifetime. And so we're going to have a little bit of fun with it outside of that. And then secondly, 25 days of draftmas is going to be coming up soon. And we're going to need some challenges for that. All right, here we go. We've got Rafinha. Bremer. Oh, I like that Rafinha. Bremer and uh, two-star, two-star on Bremer. Guardian chem style, nice stats. Jeez, I need a haircut, don't I? Um, nice defensive stats. Messi, Barkley, and Zaha. I'm going to ignore Rafinha and Bremer. I'm going to take Zaha. The reason why I'm going to ignore Rafinha is because I want Garincha. And he fits in this spot right here. And he didn't show up. But we do get Joe Cole. 4-4, four, 5-9. Four, nine, nine stats. We've got Inform Pepe. Man, just have a great season at Nice. And then come back to Arsenal and slay. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Icone, Forrest, and Mares. Not interested in those. We will be going with Joe Cole and our striker. Give me our nine again, man. No. Oh, Balotelli. Now FCC on with my main man, uh, Clayton Etai Tinga. Yes, now. Do like him. They've also signed uh, Cyprien from Nantes from last... Well, he was at Nantes last season. Um, but uh, he's barely got any game time for Sion after being injured. So there you go. Six foot three, medium low work rates, four star, four star. He's my guy. Balotelli up front. Why wouldn't you want him? Right? Come on. Where's my big boys? Kovacic, what a goal last night. Hey, we've got Jude Bellingham. Gets that link with Joe Cole. Baratti gets the link with Balotelli. Fabian, I don't care about. Parejo, I don't really care about. Baratti might be a fun one to try out, actually, on the PS4 version. Great passing. Great dribbling. Reasonable physicals, very good aggression, decent stam with the shadow chem style, very good defending. Could be a little bit slow, but four star, four star, medium high. We'll take Baratti. Next up, oh, now you give me some choices Kovacic again, Bellingham again, Rakitic and Rubinevsh, or Fedi Valverde having a cracking season for him, isn't he? Injury prone. High, high six foot. Three star, four star. It's going to have to be Valverde. It's going to be a bit difficult for me to get some good chem on these players. But, uh, ooh, maybe not as difficult as first thought. Frank Kessier, due the big upgrade. Is it Wednesday today? Yeah, by the time you're watching this, he might already have the 86 rated ones to watch. Idrissa Gay, Benjamin Andre, and Witzel actually playing centre back for Atletico Madrid uh, these days. Um, but yeah, Kessier will go in there. That midfield is tasty. Joe Cole, very nice. Zaha, very nice. Balotelli is probably the only player that we could genuinely do with a, 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 a you know, a quick upgrade. Um, Alberto Moreno, I like. Three star, two star. Damn, he's got that stash going on, hasn't he? Hey, I, I like him, but also I don't like him. That is such woeful stats. Excuse me. Every video. I don't know why. Go Moreno over Juan Bernat. I do like Juan Bernat, but... Ooh. Why not just give me the, the the rule breakers, Sergio Ramos, you know? Raulio is going to be the guy that we go for. Obviously gets the Uruguayan link to Valverde, gets the Barcelona link to Kessier, and gets the league link to the pair of them. So it's going to be very good for the chemistry overall. And then next up, Maldini. No. Um, I don't know if I care. Joe Cole, just uh, sorry, me, just a link with Joe Cole and Zaha. 
I suppose makes a bit of sense. And then at right back we'll go with Cash because otherwise it's three right wing backs or Benjamin Pavard. Man, that back line let us down massively, didn't it? Three commons. Fulleris is a good option for us. Martinez is a good option for us. Paradiki, Handanovic and Galashi. I don't really care about. We're going to go with Hugo Lloris. Overall, this draft is real nice. I need to change the striker. I need to change three of the four defenders. And I wouldn't mind having a, you know, an OP icon to put into the team. Doesn't seem like it's going to happen for us at the moment, though. Well, Kieran Tierney is an upgrade nicely. Diaz up front might be an option. I'm going to go Kieran Tierney, obviously. We gain one chemistry as well because AT is just the best. Next up, come on EA. Hook us up, baby. Gay, I just don't care for. Pepe, I don't really care for with Joe Cole there. Guerrero, don't care for. We've got Tierney. Berardi could come on as a sub. Lozano could come on as a sub, actually. Good positioning and finishing. Good pace. Nice dribbling. Good uh, stam. Four-star, three-star. High-low work rates. He's got less dribbling, less shooting, less passing, and less physical than Berardi. Berardi's also 4-3, but he's got more pace. Hey, pace. Pace is king in this game, isn't it? Hey, there we go. We get Clint Dempsey. We're going to take Clint Dempsey. We're going to start him up there instead of Balotelli. It's just better, isn't it? I know he doesn't get chemistry. Oh, now we're cooking, EA. Al... Oh, Iran. Now, Al Iran without chemistry boost is still six foot. He's still 4'4". Four, four. He's still got very good pace, good dribbling, and decent shooting. And so he's going to be the one that we put up there. And Dempsey is going to be the guy. In fact, me? Oh, no. Yeah, Dempsey and Lozano are going to be the bench boys. Next up, the defender. I just need some good defenders now. Bruno Martins Indy with 44 pace. Do you watch RZ Alkmaar EA? Obviously not. 44 pace. Disrespectful to the man. All right, Unai Simon goes in there. Five picks to go. I want an icon. I want an icon. I'm not asking. No, wait, hold on. Yeah, no, wait. I'm not asking. I'm t I'm telling. We get a super... Isn't it weird that the badge on his shirt is in line with the badge on his, on his thing? I I'm going to take a stupid nan. Four-star weak foot on the man. Might put him in at right back. Could take DeMarcos in form, actually, for that right back role instead. It actually get chemistry. Yeah, I will. I will. We lose one chem overall, but it, it improves the defense quite a bit. No one cares about these guys. Come on, and this is where we need the icons, EA. Ooh. Marino over Verratti. Give me some of that. Palinia was in there as well. That gives us six chem. This draft is very good. This draft is very good. Let's get Ritz off for uh, for cash there. I just want one icon, EA. Give me an icon striker that's French from the Premier League. They've given me Blachowicz or Ibrahimovic. Or Raul Garcia, which we could start debatably to get a bit more chemistry. And then a Premier League manager will take care of the rest. Oh, sensational. Now, the question is, do we go Neymar and sub him on for Raul Garcia? We've got Al Oiran, Dempsey, Lozano and Verratti as other subs, which is amazing. That's a really good set of subs. Do we go Hyung Min Son? Four-star, five-star versus five-star, five-star. Son's got a cracking card, hasn't he? More pace, more shooting, more physical, one less passing, but a fair bit less dribbling. I'm going to go with Hyung-Min Son. And I'm going to start Hyung-Min Son. And there you go. Now, Premier League manager would still be nice. The only player I don't like... Fiera! Whoa! The only player I don't like in this whole team is me. No, not me. Me. He's tragic. And he's going to let us down. With that being said, that's the team. Let's get into some gameplay with our 84 rated draft squad. 
I think we've had an 85 before, but that's not bad, is it? What is it? What was it? It was a a, a one one three. Oh dear! Check out my one one three foot draft. Oh my god! One one three foot draft. All right. All right, guys, here we go with our first opponent. All right, he's got a worse team than me. However, he's got Melito, Garincia. Oh, no, sorry, I beg your pardon. Jezinho and Lucio. He's also got two of the best fullbacks in the game. And Kimpembe, Kimpembe. Other than his midfield. Ah, oh, he's actually got a sick team, hasn't he? He's got a pretty poor midfield. But otherwise, he's got a pretty sick team. Let's see what... Sherko, no, don't actually be Sherko. Not, oh, thank God for that. Look at this guy. Just, just running away. Unlucky pal. Unlucky pal. Unlucky pal. Unlucky. That's a common gold goalkeeper. Hmm. Works a bit of space there, isn't he? He might be able to carve something out. Or Prowse. I'm there for that. Oh, no way. No way, man. I stood in the path of two of those passes, man. There's no way he's got that through. Come on, Zaha. I've never seen anything like it. Henderson's making these mad saves, man. Craziest half, guys. Honestly, honestly, Henderson has made some mad saves for him. I can't believe it. I actually can't believe it. Nice Joe Cole. Nice Joe Cole. How is Henderson making these saves, guys? I don't understand. No way. No way. Yay. There's no way that... There's no way he's read that, man. Oh, f*** off, man. Yeah, that's it. You just, that's it. Yeah, rebound. Yeah. Oh. How's that pass not connect game? Fuck off. Fuck off, man. That has to be a foul. He's not giving a foul for Azzy. Oh, I can't believe it. I, I I actually can't believe it. With 10 minutes to go at 3-2, there was a chance there. But 3-2. I can't, I just, I can't believe I haven't scored in that game, guys. I can't believe I haven't scored a goal in that game. I don't know. I don't understand, man. His Henderson had the most ridiculous game. An 8.2. Look at... Like, okay, the shots on the edge of the box, the Traveller shots, fair enough. He saves those or they just go wide, fair enough. Look at the shots from the penalty spot, man, and look at where he saved them. Right in the corners, in, like, good areas, and one off the bar. It's just infuriating to then go and concede goals where I feel like, and obviously I'm wrong, but I feel like I'm positioning my players in the correct positions to get the ball. You don't see the first pass, but there. It's so much pain even just looking at it because look. I've read it. That's the human control player, Ben Me. Oh, yeah. Look at his leg. It's on its way to intercept. And then, oh, no. No, we can't have that. We're just going to hold it in place in mid air and let your other leg, your trailing leg, Move so that you don't intercept the ball. And then the next pass, and I should have that. I, that that's just it there. I should have that ball. No, fuck that. Fuck that, man. I'm sorry. That is bullshit. Watch Kieran Tierney's foot here. They pull it out of the way, man. Again, yeah, Jezinho's in all the space in the world. I've read it. I've manually moved my defender into the path of the pass. Kirantini puts a leg out. He's about to get the ball. No dramas, guys. No worries. Oh, actually, I've changed my mind. Let me hit another magic wall. But let the trailing leg...
continually move. That is unacceptable. That is unacceptable. Oh, it's so triggering, man. And then to not, it, it, then it doesn't matter if you score the goals that you should score because then it's a different game. You know, if I get back in at 1 1 there or if I manage to make it 2 1 at one stage or another, who cares about those stupid animations because I'm winning the game deservedly? But when his Henderson, a 75 rated common gold goalkeeper, makes outrageous saves and I can't even get the goals that I deserve, it's just infuriating, man. It's infuriating. It's so, so frustrating, man. And I don't know the response. I know, I know the, the, the role, the responsibility is just, just get better. Make it so that you don't have those half chances or those, you know, good chances that aren't great chances. Make sure you just have great chances. I know that's the, the responsibility for me is to just improve at the game and see more passes that that has to be a joke right that they've actually put me in a pack there that has to be a joke uh I, you know i know it's on me to just be better at the game but it's so hard to want to get better at a game that's so bad man it really is it really is oh dear all right guys two gold packs and a silver players pack unfortunately nothing special in the packs unfortunately a first round exit there but if you guys are here and you enjoyed the video if you watched through that pain, I appreciate it very much. Hopefully tomorrow will be a better day for it. Thank you for watching. Damn, Tevez has lost a lot of weight, hasn't he? Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.